Hello, welcome to I Love Stocks. Today we're going to talk about NNDM. It's a printing company. As we notice, this sector has been running a little bit. I've got a little watch list traded here on the left. We've got different tickers on here. I've got NNDM, Triple D, 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 F, L, E, X, E, M, R, H, O, N. I just got it in there because that owns part of DD, uh, NNDM, I think. And then we got JBL and ITW. But these are just a small little sector watch list that I've started. And you could do the same if you like to, if that's the way you like to follow these plays. DDD's been running real well, as you can tell. And I'm going to move this over here to the left. We'll pull up the chart. It's had a nice little breakout run. It's almost tripled in uh, price. Yeah, it actually has if we were alerting it back down here under 10 bucks. It's ran all the way up to 33.50, so that's a 300% increase. And I think the stock can pull back, you know, right around that 23.50 area to start seeing a little bit of reasonable support area and it's 27.52 maybe for that first. But and that's triple D. I just figured I'd throw that in here. But that's not the main subject. The main subject is going to be NNDM. You'll take you straight to the website. Nanu Dimension. So they're a 3D uh, printing company. And they've got big contracts. They've got one with the Army, I think, uh, in the space department. As you can tell, they've got a nice little website. We've got a place in here for the investors to go to. If you're interested in checking out stock information, you know, and press releases, events and presentations coming up, the executive team, their governance. So there's a lot of good information here on, on this website. And I'm bullish on it to a certain point. Uh, one of the reasons is being in the now. They just closed on an offering, which is kind of good news to me. Under the press releases, we ought to see it in there. Let me see. Nano closes 3.3 .3 million registered direct offing. Now, this ain't the first one they've had. Actually, they've averaged about two a month in the past six months. They've had nine of them. So, but they did close it, and they're not shy from cash. They've got over a billion dollars, and they've been kind of carrying them through through this epidemic, pandemic. So it's been on a good run, this department is, and let's go ahead and go straight to the chart. In NDM, look at the 50 days. We got the SMA, been a nice little uh, four month run, especially down here from the 50 cent level. Would that be nice to own that back then? And we talked about this last Saturday breaking out of a flag, and that's what we've done here. So let's go ahead and we've got some new resistance levels that we need to break. And we'll bring this down to the 20 day, one hour. That previous high right here at 1039. That's going to be your solid support area for the first one in a way. That first one's going to be right here at 1075. We can raise that up to about 1082. So anywhere between that 75 and 82 cents is going to be your first. That second one's going to be ideal maybe to hold here at 1039 and run it back up here to right around the, I'm going to say maybe somewhere around that 1135 to 1142. And then that third support is going to be down here at 990. And that's what needs to hold this 990 area right under 10 bucks, 998. Those are your three support levels. Resistance to break around 11.42. I think we can get this triple top break sometime this week maybe and pull up here right around 12 and take it 50 cent intervals up to 15 bucks. Now be careful when they call these out to go to 30 or 25. Just be careful with them. But I do believe we could pull back to support and this could be a nice little scalper day trade holding it long. And if I was looking into the option land, I noticed there's been a lot of contracts going out on this. Maybe that $12.50 strike or that $10 strike would be nice. 
if you can get in cheaper or that 15 if you can get in right around 50 cents on a pullback maybe a little less that I use tasty works for my options trading I've got two different challenges up right now and made 95 on it yesterday so I keep adding and adding and adding and that's it with I love stocks so we'll take you back to the website today's ticker was N A N O I'm going to bring you back to the chart one more time just for a simple reminder low support anywhere between 990 to 998 just under 10 bucks that second one's right here at 1039 and then that first one's going to be right here at 1075 1082 to break resistance level of 1142 $12 long in NDM we're kind of bullish on this in this sector and going back to the website please hit that little Twitter bird follow us up here Miss Vegas is posting alerts in here all the time you can also follow me right here on stock twits get them followers up I should be due to go around the mountain to 3200 here pretty soon this is I love stocks I'll see you tomorrow